Welcome to the orientation videos that are associated with Unit 1 from Working with Health IT Systems. It takes just a moment or two, depending on the speed of your machine, for the Vista CPRS to open. You will see that this is owned by the Department of Veterans Affairs. What then opens is a patient selection box. So in essence, you could think of this as having opened a file cabinet. And within that file cabinet, are a whole slew of patient charts, and you have to pick which one you want. I don't want you to get too engrossed at this moment with all the activity on the screen. I want you to focus for a moment. If you look over here, it says Patient List. You can produce this patient list by the provider's name, so you could pick a provider from the list from a particular team, from a specialty, from a particular clinic, maybe from a particular ward or hospital unit. The default is all, and that's where we're going to start. What I am looking for in this file cabinet is the patient named Mr. 8. You could scroll, most certainly, but there are a lot of patients in here, and I am not interested in all of these patients. So I could scroll and look for patient 8, but it would probably take a while, and it's not very efficient. And you will also notice the way that these are sort ordered in here. It's alphabetical. So you'll see it's 83, 82, 82, 82, 11. You know, it's not instantly intuitive. Probably the better way for you to pull up your patient is just to start to type 8. And you will see that there are several patients with the last name of 8. There is image patient 8, there is inpatient 8, there is outpatient 8, and there's just patient 8. I am going to choose Patient 8. Click it, and it does come up. Now you can make sure this is your patient. It's showing you some data about him. He was born in 1935. He's a male, and he's a veteran. This is definitely the patient I want. I'm going to click OK. Again, depending on the speed of your machine, this will eventually populate with Mr. 8's medical record, his electronic health record. And the default view is something called Cover Sheet. So if you look down here in the lower left side, you'll see Cover Sheet, Problems, Meds, Orders, Notes, Consults, Surgery, Discharge Summary, Labs, and Reports. We'll go into those shortly, but if you remember from the lecture that the systems were set up with this tab metaphor, and remember why? Because providers, most clinicians, are very familiar with that tab metaphor, even if they've only used paper. I just want you to have a look at this for a moment. I'll come back in orientation video number two, and we will explore each of those tabs.